Welcome to the Daily Prophetic Word. And the Daily Prophetic Word for Thursday, the 19th of September 2019 is Where is your repentance? Who told you that you need not to repent? I'm calling you to repentance. And not only repentance, but a change in your life. Repentance is nothing in my sight if you continue to sin. To repentance is to ask for forgiveness and to stop doing it. Where is your repentance? Only a bride without spot and wrinkle will go into the escape. Nobody is part of my bride without repentance and changing or his, her ways. The narrow path through me will lead to the heavenly kingdom, and I am the way, the truth and the life, and nobody will come to the Father than through me. Where is your repentance? Change your life, repent of all your sins, and stop doing them. Come out of the world in Babylon. Leave your lukewarm churches and walk the true narrow path of the gospel of the kingdom. There is only one way that will give you eternal life, and it cannot be found in the world nor Babylon. And this was the daily prophetic word for Thursday, the 19th of September 2019. Where is your repentance? We have to understand that we have to repent. And when we repent of our sins, then we have to give up the sins. We have to chase them away from our life and change our life completely so that we can come closer and closer to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. Praise God Almighty that he has sent us his only begotten Son so that we can be saved. But you will not be saved without repentance, without changing your life. Even Paul struggled his whole life against sin. He always said he had a son in his flesh. So repentance is very, very important. And it also makes you humble in front of the Lord, so that you not become prideful and haughty, as many people today do. They say, we have found the right way, we have found the right ministry. And then they claim things that was never written in the Bible. And they claim things that makes them prideful. Instead, let us be humble in front of our Lord and Savior. Let us take our cross and walk the narrow path. And if he will guide us through the wilderness, then we know that he will be with us together and he will provide for us. Thank you that you have listened to this daily prophetic word. And if you like to sow into our ministry, then please follow the links in the description box below. We also have still the case of baby Grace and the family needs some support so that baby Grace can heal. The operation went well, everything is all right and on the good way and we thank the Lord for it. Praise the Lord. But now please come forth and help so that the family can have some support for baby Grace. I will put a link in the first pin comment. Follow that link to our Patreon page and there you will see a certain page for baby Grace and the family. Or if you want to help our ministry that is in the mission to Cambodia right now, there's also a link there for Jesus and the children and the Impact Week. You can also use there to make a donation. Thank you for your help. Please come forth and support us so that we can establish societies of the rose in all the nations and that our messages will reach all the corners in the world. Thank you for your help. I hope I will see you again tomorrow. My name is Michael. I am the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Past Movement Foundation. May God bless you and your family abundantly. Have a great day. Maranatha.